Readings. First John chapter 2 verse 28 says, And now little children abide in him that when he appears we may have a confidence and not be ashamed at his coming. Jesus wants every one of us to have a close communication with him, a close fellowship with him, an intimate relationship with him. And those who are abiding with him surely strengthens themselves, strengthens themselves in every area of their life, in their talks, in their walks, in their job, in their studies, in every areas of their life, they are going to be stronger and confident. And even at the coming of the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, they will not be ashamed. They will not be sorry to people because those who abide in Him will never be ashamed at the coming of the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. My friends, the Lord's coming is very near. We don't have much time to prepare. But whatever the time which we are receiving now, redeem the time because the days are evil and when you are going to redeem your time and set yourself apart from the world and the worldly lust and join with Jesus Christ surely you are going to be stronger and stronger at the coming of the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ there are many unfortunate things going to be happen at the coming of the Lord you should not be that you should not be sorry person at that time you should be stronger and stronger when the Lord is going to come back to take us. But on for that, you need to abide with Him every day of your life, in every areas of your life. Be with focus with Jesus Christ. Be abide with Him and move forward your life. Surely you are going to be blessed this day when you are going to do your work abiding in Him. Have a wonderful day and God bless you.